Last night, more than a dozen demonstrators took to the streets on Saipan, calling for the impeachment of Governor Ralph Torres. This morning, we asked Torres if he denies all charges and if he's innocent. Of course, absolutely. He says he wants to put the issue to rest, but the wheels are in motion at the legislature. It's likely that two-thirds or 14 members of the House will vote to impeach the governor in the coming weeks or months. I'm very confident that uh, at the end of the day, uh, that uh, you know, if they have the numbers for the House, uh, I'm sure that in the Senate, uh, I will be given the fair um, approach. And uh, I'm confident that uh, that proceeding will not go further. On Monday, uh, House Speaker Edmund Villagomez announced that he will form a special will committee on impeachment. On Torres requested that lawmakers appointed to that committee aren't biased and don't have complaints of their own. Tina Sablon, for example, she's running for governor. Uh, so politically already, uh, she has a motive to make sure that she'll try everything she can um, to remove me because that's one less... Uh, um, opponent on her. Uh, and I'm just saying facts again. Those facts in black and white paint a different picture for each party. Tomas Manglotnia for KUAM News on Saipan.